these stones up there at the top. in Jesus Christ our Lord. Thanks be to God. Jesus said, You are the light of the world. A city built on a hill cannot be hid. No one lights a lamp to put it under a bucket, but on a lampstand, where it gives light for everyone in the house. And you, like the lamp, must shed light among your fellow men, so that they may see the deed you do and give glory to your Father in heaven. Let us pray. Almighty God, we give you thanks for surrounding us as daylight fades with the brightness of your vesper light. And we implore you of your great mercy that as you enfold us with the radiance of this light, so you would shine into our hearts the brightness of your Holy Spirit through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Lighten our darkness, we beseech thee, O Lord, and by thy great mercy defend us from all perils and dangers of this night, from all traffic that may get in our way, for the love of thy only Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. O gracious light, pure brightness of the ever-living Father in heaven, O Jesus Christ, holy and blessed, now as we come to the setting of the sun and our eyes behold the vesper light, we sing your praises, O God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. You are worthy at all times to be praised by happy voices. O Son of God, O giver of life, and to be glorified through all the worlds. As our reflection tonight, I invite you to share any instant or moment where you have caught a glimmer of the kingdom of heaven, um, whether you caught a glimpse of God's presence in some way, or where you were moved by the Spirit. If you'd like to share, you may do that. God's light is everywhere. Um, maybe even like when somebody's gonna hurt you or beat you up, that's still a place where there's light. I was especially struck by seeing the um, books, the, the scriptures and all, when we were in there looking at the icons. And um, just being that close to something that was that old and that sacred. I think the moment that I'm going to remember the most is that man sitting with his dog in the, when we were in the metro station. I could I could hardly get by. <laughs> Sorry, it just it really hit me. Yeah. I've seen it many, many times before, but for some reason today 
I saw it in a different light. There were things totally different than what I'd noticed before. Either it was just the museum's brightness, or it was just a bigger canvas. I'm just joking. <laughs> How he incorporated the, the ascension also, which I never noticed before. I think the remnant of the piece of art at the exhibit that was uh, the washing of the feet with St. Andrew, I, I just kept staring at that. It's just, to me, it was very moving. Moved by seeing all the families and people out enjoying the beauty of the day and the beauty of the city, and thankful that we could get out and do that. It's all been in my mind. today that were this kind of it, time slowed down and I appreciated that moment. Um, the person playing the music on the corner of the street oh. and stopping and talking mm -hmm. with him um, mm -hmm. and the interest that he took in Evan in his musical yes, yeah. education. Yeah. Um, the lady that dropped the cell phone and Danny chased her down to give it back to her. <laughs> Tired. Um, <laughs> and, um, Actually I found that, oh, that how did he know that I played an instrument. Mm. I was like this to myself. Holy cow! I mean, <laughs> maybe a calf, but it's Jesus! <laughs> maybe he's telling you to play <laughs> something. David, anything from you? I was also very touched by the lady that led us into the cathedral. Something that is held as precious to one generation can still be precious you know, thousands of years later. Let us pray in the words that our Savior Christ has taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be always with you. Peace be with you. Is that it? Not yet? One more prayer before we Peace with you, David. Peace be with you. Peace, Ernest.